hopefully with Dr. Einstein's help, I'll be able to resist going through the change. Dr. Einstein, Mr. Harry Page and Miss Etta Greenlee. Welcome to Castle Einstein. I hope I might be of help with your problem. Oh, Dr. Einstein, I fear I was bitten by... That is correct, Frida. Place it on the coffee table. Yeah, yeah, doctor. On the table. Frida is my housekeeper. She is Frederick's great grandmother. How nice. She should have retired years ago, but the old dear loves to work, so I let her continue. I just don't have the heart inside of me. Will you excuse me? I just remembered something I must add to my shopping where am I going? To the coffee table. Where is it? Here. Where? Here. Parker. That's good, Frida. Just a couple more steps. I was hoping you would see. That is what my work is all about. Life. In my laboratory, I have created the world's very first... Well, perhaps I will show you later, but... I think... Also! Master, they're coming! <laughs> I saw them from the tower. They're in a caravan, like you said, but their wagon wheels are stuck in the mud. This way! This way! You go out and some prey off the thought. Fix it in the past, Professor Wonder, but this is the worst. You know I hate to get my beer wet. It frizzes and I can't do a thing with it. But you complaining. It is not the storm that worries me, Harriet. That is passing old. It is the sunrise that concerns me. One ray, and poof, I turn to dust. Dust isn't so bad, as long as you stay dry, which isn't easy in this weather. Watch out for that puddle. Maybe Giganticus could carry him? I can't. I've got a bad back. Whip, some strong man you are. Oh, leave me alone. I think my sore throat's getting worse. How long have you had that sore throat, Nick? Three years. And how long have you been a sore swallower? Three years. How long have y'all been the Siamese twins? How long have you been in it with Nick? Siamese twins that join our birth? I knew that. I just forgot. You don't have any personal, Bella. Sorry, I'm annoying to get a mood right now. I had a perfectly good job belly dancing at the Coney Island Midway. When the professor said, join my troop and see the world. Well, all I see is a bunch of trees. Stop your belly aching. Dr. Einstein has promised to provide us with a new attraction that'll put our carnival back on top again. <laughs> again? I must have slept for the first time. What about it, Madam Clara? Will a new attraction make us a hit? Ah! ah, ah ask me this, and now I got such a hit it. <laughs> <laughs> My feet are tired. Can we rest a minute? No! Idiot! Yes? <laughs> I wasn't talking to you. <laughs> how much for the new castle? Hey, how about an answer? Oh, were you talking to me? I hope Professor Wanda's right about our becoming a big success. I'll never be able to buy any more tattoos, but I'll start getting paid. The one you have is very nice, Diane. Well, thank you. This place gives me the creep. Just stay close to me, Pearl. Like I have a choice. I hope this Dr. Einstein has some aspirin. My head is killing me. You know, you think a good fortune tell be able to see a headache coming and take something for it beforehand? Oh, shut up before I put the hex on you! <laughs> <laughs> Careful what you say to Madame Clara, Jean Free. She's crankier than the time you dropped her kiss the ball on her, Joe. <laughs> so far, in. so far, it's this thing. <laughs> Your silly idiots, I can see how you got the job. Oh, thank you. There are three other applicants, including an imbecile. I was so happy they picked me. <laughs> you mean we've been going the wrong way all the time? Oh, I knew I should have worn that head on my own. I was offered a job testing shaving cream. But now, I had to join a carnival. Oh. I should 
sure hope Dr. Einstein can help us. I've been on pins and needles to meet him. You know, girls, if this Dr. Einstein is a medical doctor, maybe he can perform an operation to separate you. Have you ever thought about that? What? And give up show business? I hope he's a medical doctor. I need some prescription for lozenges. I just remembered something. I should have known the fools in us the bomb vet. When I read the tarot cards this morning, the card with the Casatani came out, it was upside down. Now you remember. Madame Clara Cecil remembers Zil. You're going to get such a head! Stop it right now, girls. I won't have you fighting. Yes, mummy. <laughs> No. Ah, Frederick, you brought Harry and Etta? I'll have to do something for you, sir. They'll be in your laboratory shortly. Okay. Now, where was I? I thought you said they were coming. They are coming shortly. Calm down, Professor. Just go over there. Play with your fingers. <laughs> now. Leave me, leave me, leave me, leave me, leave me. Okay. Calm down. <laughs> now, do you need some rubbing up? up? <laughs> okay. Sheesh. Uh, let me see if that. Come on in. Uh, Frederick, send all off to me. I might require his assistance later. At once, Dr. Armstrong. Thank you. <laughs> and I have your attention, please. You see the hall. <laughs> Mine must have been some regular. You see? I knew those villagers were organizing a big sale. I said we should never have come here. I told you I didn't like this place, didn't I, Opal? Didn't I? Incessantly, Pearl. Now calm down before you hyperventilate and we both faint. Listen. Some chili pepper to give it some zip. They're getting closer. A tiny little bit, but that was an accident. We have to get out of here. Help! Somebody help me! A baby. Please! Someone help me! Etta, what's wrong? Why are you so wound up? That's some strange coming from her. Don't let her take me. <gasps> Professor Wonder! Professor Wonder? Some crabgrass. Why are you working with Professor Wonder? She's a terrible woman. She and Dr. Einstein have concocted a horrible scheme. <gasps> they plan on turning Harry into a real werewolf permanently. The man I love would be gone forever. No! Yes! And that's not all. <gasps> Dr. Einstein has created a monster from dead bodies and is making it a mate. And whatever parts he's missing, he plans to take from me. No! Yes! The poor girl, no wonder he's so torn up. Hi, needles. What would the professor have done such evil deeds? Because she wants to display the monster, its bride and Harry in your carnival. But that just won't do. Baron and I were already among the undead when Dr. Einstein found us but to kill someone. And to turn a semi lycanthrope into a full time werewolf? No! We will not let him get away with it. No. I don't believe he's mad. Baron and Winter on the net. Had a green leaf. Parsley, sage, rosemary, and thyme. There you are. Come with me. Guys, get out of the way. Dr. Einstein needs the girl. We heard an editor told us what he needs her for. So, think of what we'll do for business. We don't need that kind of business, Professor. I don't have time to argue with you. You got that right. There's an angry mob on the way here to burn the castle to the ground. What? Then we've got to hurry. She's coming with me. You're not taking Edda anywhere, Professor. I <laughs> am? <laughs> Maybe who's going to stop me? You? <laughs> That's a laugh. I'll stop you. <gasps> Well, 